And a long time ago, we used to have a gyroscope here. It's a very, very popular. And it's been gone for about uh, 10 years or so, I think. So we've brought it back permanently and because we keep getting questions every year. We get lots of questions about where the gyroscope is and we have to tell them, unfortunately, we don't have one. So now we can tell them that we have a gyroscope and you can ride it. And what you can do in that is you can spin around all three axes. So it's actually uh, sort of a, something that astronauts used once for, for astronaut training in the 60s to figure out how they could stop a tumbling uh, spacecraft. <laughs> Can't like spin me to get me started? Okay, now How do I go side to side? Well, you have to lean sideways. And you can grab, yeah, there you go. Oh, cool. <laughs> what a cool view from here. There yeah. we go, yeah, you just gotta go for it. This is really aimed at teenagers and adults, so uh, minimum height is five feet, maximum height is six two, and also there's a maximum weight of 225 pounds. Uh, those are actually very close to the requirements um, for astronauts, so if you meet the requirements to be an astronaut, then you can ride our human gyroscope, and otherwise, unfortunately, you won't be able to. So I survived the human gyro. Uh, it took a little bit of nerve to get my feet over my head, but as soon as I was there, it felt amazing. You don't get any feelings of being dizzy. It's just a really neat experience.